In this video, we will look into a Shopify pass builder which goes by the name Geno Pass Builder. This is not the first time review, I have been using Geno Pass Builder for a while and I absolutely love it. So, in this video, I'm gonna be giving you the reason why I think Geno Pass Builder is an amazing pass builder. In a moment, I'm going to jump into my computer and walk you through the app. But first, let me share with you some benefits of using Xeno Pass Builder. Just by using Xeno Pass Builder, you can save a lot of time and money trying to hire the right developer to create your dream Shopify store because you can do all this by yourself. Secondly, you can design in any way you imagine without any limits. Whether it's a home page, product page, collection page, blog post, or even card page, you can design any page you want for your Shopify store with Geno Pass Builder. And the best part is that you can do all this without prior knowledge of coding and even building a Shopify store. Even if you are a complete beginner, it is really simple and easy to use Xeno Pass Builder. Plus, it comes with really great features and elements which you cannot find in any other app. Alright, so here's the app. It is called Geno Pass Builder. This is available as an app in the Shopify App Store. Now, let's go inside the app and let me walk you through the features of this app. Once you are inside the app, the first thing you will notice is the clean layout, the clean UI. Unlike other pass builder apps which have many buttons and things going all over the pages, here you can see it is really clean and simple. So it is beginner friendly, at the same time simple and easy to use but it is really effective. The next great feature is that it can be used to create all kinds of pages. The first is the landing page with which you can create almost any kind of page. It can be FAQ, about a space or whatever you want. It can also be used to create home page. So if you want to design a custom home page, uh, you can use it. The next is the blog post. The next is product page. So you can use this product page to create the product page for any uh, product you have. You can actually create differently for all the products so it doesn't have to be same. And the same thing for collection pages, you can create different for different collections. And lastly, you can even customize the card page and the 4 or 4 page. So uh, there is nothing uh, you can't customize here, you can customize all kinds of pages. There is a feature which can save you a lot of uh, time. So if I click on this new page, you can see that it already has a lot of pre-made templates. So for this home page, you can see that it already has pre-made templates which you can simply use. But uh, also, even if you want to make changes to these templates, you can change it later. In case you want to change the text or the color or the design, you can all do that. Now let's just start a simple page and let me show you the features available. Alright, you just have to type in the page name and the path. You can also toggle the theme header and footer and then just click on create page and here you can find all kinds of elements and it's really simple and it's straightforward if it says heading it's a heading text is text image is image video is video and so on all right so if you want a heading you just can simply drag it and you just can drop it all right it's simple you just drag and drop it all right let's say you want a uh, uh, video you just can drag you just can drop it it will be right under the heading all right uh, one thing you will notice is that once you uh, select an element or once you drag it there, this sidebar will show the settings of the element where you can change uh, the font, the color, almost everything. Here for the video as well, you can even change the aspect ratio. You can change if you want to mute the audio, if you want to change the video, everything. You just can simply delete an element as simple as this. And as you can see, there are lots and lots of elements which you can use, meaning you can create uh, any kind of page you want without any limit. Whatever page you imagine in your mind, you can use all this element to construct that, alright? And if you are interested to see what kind of pages this can create, I already have a video on that one going through all these different elements and creating a page. I will link the video down below if you are interested. If you have any question, please leave a comment below and I will definitely reply to your comment. If you do enjoy it, please do like this video and also make sure you subscribe to this channel. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Peace.